gorgeous wags, daring rebel golfers, talented musical artists, and even a former president. There was definitely no shortage of famous faces at this event. Join us as we take you inside the star-studded LIV Golf Welcome Party. Numerous golf players are getting paid a lot of money to sign up to the Saudi-backed breakaway group, and the whole thing is causing a golf civil war. LIV Golf just announced a 14-tournament schedule for 2023, with a £336 million prize fund to avoid clashing with the Majors or Ryder Cup, and it's being fronted by none other than the two-time major winner Greg Norman. Their third invitational tournament is being hosted at Donald Trump's course in Bedminster, New Jersey. And that's why the former president was seen with his wife, Melania Trump, at Gotham Hall in New York on the 27th of July, 2022. He was also pictured shaking hands with Caitlyn Jenner and chatting with Greg Norman and Dustin Johnson, who arrived with his wife, Paulina Gretzky, the 33-year-old daughter of hockey legend Wayne Gretzky. And she looked absolutely stunning in her black cutout mini dress. American professional golfer Pat Perez and his wife Ashley also enjoyed themselves at the event. Rapper Nelly and popular DJ Jamie Perez provided live entertainment for the party. Other golfers like Patrick Reed, Brooks Keepa, Lee Westwood, Henrik Stenson, and Ian Poulter have also defected to accept the Saudi Public Investment Fund cash. While the American Players PGA Tour membership has been ripped up and as it stands, will be banned from representing the United States at the next Riders' Cup in September. Roy McIlroy, Irish professional golfer, chastised the players who have joined the LIV series and accused them of fueling resentment and iconic American professional golfer Tiger Woods doesn't understand them breaking away after reportedly rejecting an £820 million offer. But it seems that the rebel golfers remain unaffected by all of this as they were seen partying on a private jet ahead of the Open. Patrick Reed even rocked up to St. Andrews in LIV golf-branded clothes, Ian Poulter was booed on the first tee, and Henrik Stenson was stripped of the Ryder Cup captaincy. Even though the 2016 Open champion was announced as the captain for next year's tournament at Marco Simone Golf and Country Club in Rome only four months ago. Ryder Cup Europe claimed that Henrik Stenson would be unable to fulfill his role due to his joining of the Breakaway Rebel Series. Stenson, pocketing the £40 million signing fee from LIV, was criticized by English professional golfer Eddie Pepperell, who says that Stenson just couldn't resist the bucket load of cash thrown at him like other defectors. Colin Montgomery even called Stenson's decision to leave the captaincy for Saudi cash a sad day for European golf. Stenson expressed how he disagreed with the decision, but accepts it for now and he still wishes all of them the best.